Okay, so I'm here today um, at Advanced Therapies in London with Roberto from AGC Biologics. Roberto, thanks for joining me. Thank you, and I'm happy to be here, to be here with you. Okay, um, so my first question, can you just introduce yourself and tell us a bit about your role? Yes, my name is uh, Roberto Formisano, uh, Process Transfer Senior Manager at AGC Biologics in Milan site. So uh, my uh, role is to uh, transfer the processes from our development to GMP manufacturing and uh, from our customer to our GMP manufacturing passing through our development for uh, feasibility and optimization. And uh, I'm also involved uh, in the um, in the scouting of new materials and technologies uh, to accommodate the request from uh, our customer and the, the latest uh, um, improvements uh, from the, the world the marketing of, uh, of new uh, technologies. And what are the main challenges um, facing technology transfer from a developer into a CDMO? Yes, the, um, the, most, uh, the biggest challenges uh, for the tech transfer in our field uh, uh, are more related to the uh, very critical timelines because uh, our customer uh, usually um, needs a few months to reach the, um, the first clinical trial. Uh, so we need uh, to uh, accommodate their request uh, the, as, um, the best as we can so uh, we can uh, um, try to find the, um, the right compromise between the number of batches that we can uh, uh, manufacture to have uh, a significant uh, and uh, a scientifically uh, uh, data and uh, at the same time to uh, meet their requests in terms of timelines. So this is, in my opinion, the, the biggest challenge. Um, and what are your recommendations for the companies looking to CDMOs, um, thinking of tech transfer? You know, when should they come to you to, to, to start speaking, etc.? For sure, um, as um, if the, the customer has a, a, a robust process already developed, uh, could be easier to transfer the process to GMP manufacturing. Uh, otherwise, we uh, can offer our platforms uh, for uh, LVV and the AAV uh, viruses. So uh, in these cases, uh, uh, we can have uh, already a process uh, uh, assessed uh, in GMP manufacturing. Um, and usually we are really proactive to find the best solution. So uh, we always try to, um, to squeeze the, the timeline as best as we can. Okay, fantastic. And just a final question. Like, what is your prediction um, cell and gene therapy space for 2024? For sure, we are moving to um, biggest scale for the um, viral vector. So um, we need to uh, think about the scale up of processes and uh, also to uh, reduce the cost of, uh, of manufacturing. And so we have to use our ingenuity to, to find uh, always the best solution. Fantastic. Well, thank you for joining me, Roberto. Thank you.